Hey, I'm Cameron McKenzie. You can follow me on Twitter at CameronMCNZ, and I wanted to quickly show you how you can clone a tag. So I've got my GitLab repository here. There's the repository. I'm going to take a look at all of the different branches and commits that I have. There's some branches, there's some commits. Taking a look at the repository as a whole, you can see I've got develop, master, release, and hotfix branches. But I've also got an old tag, 1.0.0-rc-1. And it's this particular tag that I want to check out. So how do you do it? Well, you get the clone URL. You can get that from GitHub, GitHub or GitLab or Bitbucket, whatever you're using. Then I'm going to open up a terminal and then go to git clone. I'm going to paste the URL in, but I'm also going to add a reference to the tag. And the reference is actually branch. So you actually say branch and you actually say double double branch, double dash branch, and then the name of the branch. Now what the heck was the branch here? It was 1.0.0-rc.1. So I'll do that, put in my password. Now something interesting is going to happen here because this tag is not the latest branch. There's been commits since this tag was created. So it's going to get a little ornery on me and it's going to tell me, look, you're in a detached head state, so be careful with any commits because you're not going to be able to connect to the uh, historic blockchain of the Git repository, but that's fine for me. Now, if I do an ls command, you'll notice that I've got uh, that folder created. I meant to go in there, so cd gitlab made easy. There we go. Now, you notice that the files that I've got, I've got feature home, blah, 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 blah. Two files that I don't have. I don't have a file called master.html, and I don't have a file called develop.html. And if you actually go to the master branch, you would notice that the master branch has a file called master.html. And if you went to the develop branch, you'd see that the develop branch has got a file called develop.html. And both of those commits have happened since the tag was added, right? So the problem is I've now done a I've now done a clone of the tag, but the tag is ancient. And so, um, you know, I can't really kind of continue on from that point. But the bottom line is I did actually go and I did uh, clone a tag and that's how you do it. Basically, you just use the branch command and your tag will come in. Just be careful of that detached head state. And that's all there is to it. And anyways, if you can sort out that detached head of yours, why don't you go follow me on Twitter at CameronMCNZ and head over to the serverside.com. Lots of other Git tutorials, GitHub, GitLab, Bitbucket tutorials, and everything to do with server-side develop from agile to microservices, just plain old software development. See you there.